Meet Dr. Panda. Dr. Panda is an excellent educator and is always looking for tools and resources to leverage for student success in the classroom. Dr. Panda is looking forward to the upcoming year, especially because Dr. Panda's institution selected the learning management system, Canvas. Dr. Panda is always looking for tips and practices on making their Canvas course more effective. Their students, like Tucker Panderson, love Dr. Panda's course. The course is easy to navigate for Tucker, uses tools to keep the content engaging, and all of the course communication, feedback, and grades are in one spot. Dr. Panda confidently builds course content because they regularly use the Canvas training portal to receive official training resources from the Canvas Learning Services Department. The Learning Services Department consists of education leaders ranging from primary grades teachers to higher education faculty and have skills in areas such as curriculum design, instructional design, school leadership, Canvas LMS administration, and support. Dr. Panda regularly checks in on these training resources for tips, best practices, and practical applications of Canvas in the classroom and for virtual teaching and learning. Accessing the portal is a snap for Dr. Panda, assuming pandas can snap. Dr. Panda opens their Canvas instance or account and from the global navigation bar, selects the help icon at the bottom left. From this menu, Dr. Panda selects Training Services Portal. The first time Dr. Panda opened the Training Services Portal, an authentication screen appeared, as well as an authorization screen. Dr. Panda selected Authorize on both of these screens. After the first time, Dr. Panda only sees one authorization screen, making sure Dr. Panda has access to the correct material. A tutorial slide deck then appears. Dr. Panda knows how to use the training portal already, so they select the last circle on the screen and chooses Don't Show Me Again. Please note, the Training Services Portal is not available on free for teacher accounts. Once Dr. Panda is in the Training Services Portal, they can see the entire library of available content. Dr. Panda sees different categories of content, which are organized by learning experience. Dr. Panda can choose Learning Pathways, which are groups of self-paced courses centered around a common theme, or individual courses, self-paced courses focused on a specific Canvas skill or practice, or from videos, short training videos combining how-to with trainer tips to help instructors apply the skills in their individual Canvas courses. Dr. Panda's institution purchased subscription training so they can see and attend live webinars, as well as access specialized Canvas resources. Dr. Panda's colleague at a different institution, Dr. Red Panda, does not have subscription access, but still sees plenty of free training content within the Canvas Training Services Portal. Dr. Panda loves that the learning library of content is constantly growing. With all the content, Dr. Panda can easily filter and search for content they need right now. At the top right of the screen, Dr. Panda can sort by content and they can use tags to make sure they see training content specific to their role as an instructor. Once Dr. Panda finds the training material they are looking for, they select the course tile. Dr. Panda selects Enroll when prompted, and they read the description of the training content. At this point, Dr. Panda can choose whether or not to register for that particular training offering. When participating in a learning pathway, Dr. Panda sees all of the courses within the pathway and monitors their progress at the top of the page. Each course in the learning pathway has a unique agenda. 
showing Dr. Panda what content will be covered in the course. Dr. Panda can even download the agenda by selecting the paperclip icon. Dr. Panda's institution purchased Canvas subscription training, giving Dr. Panda and their colleagues access to live webinar sessions with members of the Canvas training team. Dr. Panda loves using these live subscription training sessions to ask questions about Canvas functionality and learn directly from members of the official Canvas training team. To find a session, Dr. Panda either scrolls to the bottom of the learning library to live trainings or accesses the learning library tab. Dr. Panda chooses from a list of scheduled sessions and selects the name of the session they would like to attend. They select register. Then Dr. Panda checks their email with a session reminder and a Zoom link for the session. When the appointed time arrives, Dr. Panda makes sure to open the Canvas training portal first before joining the session with the Zoom webinar link. For each completed course, learning pathway, or live webinar session, Dr. Panda receives either a certificate or a badge. Dr. Panda loves to show off their digital badges in their email signature and on social media accounts. Dr. Panda loves to encourage their colleagues to use the Canvas Training Services portal through their help menu and values the resources provided that help them create great courses that effectively support student learning.